Stephen do that? Oh my God, why you didn't tell me that this was going on? Listen, I understand you're ashamed, but, but Maria, you, you have people that will help you. But it's not right. Maria, no, it don't matter what it is you say or do. He have no right to be beating you. Look, I coming over, right? Coming over by you right now. Wait, before I go, I text in your number. What if I told you someone you know is experiencing what Maria is facing? If you think you know someone who is experiencing gender-based violence, you can help. The COVID-19 pandemic has created significant challenges for us, specifically the women and the girls in our communities. Women and girls are now forced to share their home spaces with abusers and perpetrators with very little access to social services, safety, or support. If you know someone who could be experiencing domestic violence, here are some ways that you can help. Learn all you can about abuse and teach your friends and family to spot the signs of a victim or an abuser. Actively listen to someone who you believe needs help. Don't judge and don't offer unsolicited advice. Call the National Domestic Violence Hotline at 800 save Someone's well-being may be dependent on it. This is a message from the Office of the Prime Minister, Gender and Child Affairs.